Well, for the next part coming up, uh, is I'm just prepping some stock here, and so these are one by sevens. What I'm doing is I'm putting a hundred thou step in there, one inch in. What that does, that gives me a six inch surface there, because I'm going to mount it in the vise on the CNC mill like this. Why? Because my serrated jaws, my serrated jaws, I can span six inches. I cannot span seven. I'm doing it at 100 thou depth. The serrated jaws only need 60. So that means that this bottom edge here will sit on the jaw. You know, it'll sit on this part of the jaw uh, on both sides. Okay, it'll sit like that on that side and grab it. And then this one, be easier to see if I clean the burrs up, but uh, it will go in there and sit like that. And while I'm here, let me just double check that, oh yeah, I've got plenty of daylight in there between the top of the serrated jaw and the bottom of that lip. So these things will grab it no problem. I'm not worried about them at all. So once they grab it, I'll be able to do my whole operation on the top side. And then when I flip it over, CNC mill is not going to care about that missing one inch. Not at all. And of course, then the next question is, well, why didn't I move the jaws to the outside of the vise on there? Well, I don't feel like moving the carp smart jaws. Not for four pieces, you know. So it was very easy to take out these two bolts, move this one over, and then I can just drop it down in there, tighten it up. The first piece of stock I did, I did at 100 thou depth. I took the whole cut. doesn't matter if it's a little rough uh, or if the edges are perfectly smooth. It's not going to be touching the surface that the bottom is creating and the edge. Um, it's going to sink into that and bite into that with the serrations anyway. So that's not a big deal either. Um, I did turn the head of the round column over to the side so that I could have the overhang off the edge of the vise here. That way I could keep the stock a little bit closer to uh, center before I ran out of uh, travel uh, instead of having it you know, clamped way over here. The vise is not in the center of the table. Too nice a shelf space here. <laughs> set it down at roughly 50 thou. And you know, I've played with the speeds and stuff like that so I've got it set where I want it. It's just kind of a guess and an eyeball but 